Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. I'm Scott. Born here. We got us a rum. It's a Hampton. Ooh, a rum. Hampton. Hamp Hampton. Hampton. Front of the box, same as the back. Can't tell which is which. We will test it. Jamaican rum style. Ooh, you Jamaican me crazy. Somebody actually pointed out recently, hey, you guys have done some, well, we did a couple tequilas. Right. Um, did we even do a rum a while back? Yes. I think we've done, uh, we even did a rum that was uh, SMWS back in the day. Oh, well, yeah. But it was more recently. Maybe not. Maybe it was just the tequilas. And somebody had said, hey, I noticed you guys are kind of doing some more spirits. Yeah. It's like, well, we've done them. Just right. not that many. Yes, mostly bourbon or American scotch. Can you smell it? I can smell it, actually. We're both a little stuffed up. Look, I was, I was going to say we're going to have to yeah. rely on you, and right. you were going to have to say rely Can't. on me. My left nostril's good. The right is obstructed. We are in Wichita, Kansas, and in the spring, there's yeah. these wild temperature. Yes. We've been up in the 70s, uh, waking up with 50s like and 60s, and then today we wake up, it's 27. Yeah. And... And there's all this pollen in the air, and it blows crazy. Yeah. Man, I can still smell this, though. So yeah. this is this is the Hampton uh, Great House Rum, Distillery Edition 2023, 57% ABV. Good. So a cask strength. This one is not a typical rum. This one, think Campbelltown whiskey. Oh, really? It's got a little funk? A little funk. Wow. So this was Dustin from R&J uh, Discount Liquors here Just in Wichita. Huh? He suggested it? No, he brought this one over. Oh. Uh, we had some whiskey buddies over, and he brought this one over and left it. Got it. Nice cut. But, uh, but then we picked up another one, which we're going to review next. Got it. So the Sherry Cat, a Sherry Cast Hampton. Now, with rooms, next week. Uh, a lot of times they're using the byproduct from sugarcane and molasses. Does this say it's using the pure sugarcane? Oh, yeah. I know. You better get the microscope, too, or you... It's... it's uh, where is it? There? Oh, it's right there. Oh, yeah. Not I microscope. Forgot. Sorry. The, the um, magnifying Magnifier. Glass. Our, dist our master distiller created this blend using the most representative marks of our distillery, blah, 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 represents the authentic expression of this unique and unrepeatable style of Trelawney rums. Okay. Um, da, da, da. That does not indicate anything about your uh, molasses question style. Got it. Okay. Maybe it does on the box. Who knows? It's fully matured at the Hampton Estate Distillery. All right, in the big house. Distilled in our house. pot stills at the Hampton Estate Distillery, Trelawney, like Jamaica. Okay. Seven hundred and fifty milliliter. So you, you have no hate there, baby. Dustin. Dustin would know the answer to your question. He would. Skilled. Skilled man. Like oh, yeah. not wow. Good. That is a... That is, I mean, it's earthy. It's... I'm not getting funk, though. Oh, yeah. I maybe, mean, it's... Really? Maybe the funk's my right nostril. Yeah. Ooh. Boy, strong. It jumps out of the glass. Good jump. Got my nose. It's... It's rum-ish style on the nose. Not near as sweet. As you normally expect, Whoop. for that brown sugar molasses type. I didn't expect that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. The, How did it catch me? <laughs> well, you might 57%. Yeah, but 57 doesn't catch me like that. Wow. Mm. Holy moly. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. See what I mean about kind of funky, kind of earthy? Uh, yeah, I guess. It's not, it's not that... Off the shelf rum, True. sweet molasses syrupy, right? Uh, sugar cane. This is yeah. It's got a dusty barn on the finish. Yeah, it's oaky, earthy, kind of burnt caramels. Maybe a little bit of, maybe a touch of old Dunnage this, in the background. Yeah, Dunnage. Yeah, that's for the that's probably the earthiness mm. that I'm saying. Yeah, kind of a Dunnage. Uh, 
Dunnage would be a, a dirt style a warehouse uh, in Scotland. You're exactly right. That's what that is. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you've walked into a an old warehouse. There is the sugar cane. Yeah. L light to mid, not overbearing. I see what you're saying. There's a slight funk there. Still think I'm a little hampered by my completely unclear olfactory. You want to drop hefty? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. There's kind of a burnt brown sugar almost, or a burnt sugar cane. It's a it's a toastedness. Toast almost well. It's almost smoky. Almost like take sugar cane and you peel peel those pieces down and you're toasting them or burning them. Apricot. Hmm. It's definitely not a normal rum. No. Almost caught me there again, too. Why is the, ABA, the ABV seems like it's in the 64s or something? <laughs> Maybe it's my nose lying to me, but oh, wow. A little bit of an ether alcohol yeah. note. Maybe that's what's doing it. Could be. A little ether, bit of a... Would that be the is that ether alcohol? Yeah. Almost be. like... You got a little floral there. Hmm? What is that? Maybe maybe even a fruity... Like you said apricot? Mm -hmm. Apricot? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's apricot if you're edgy, edgy macated. Oh, apricot, not ape. You don't have a ape. Hey, give me an apricot. No. <laughs> I want an apricot. Water. I don't know if it's doing anything. Didn't hurt it. Didn't seem like it changed it at all. Didn't change it. This is a great sipping rum. Neat. I mean, completely, totally different. I think it's or unique. I would say. But I don't know if I've had another rum this earthy, you'd say? Right. This makes me wonder what, whenever I have these different rums that are a little bit more, I don't know, not your off the shelf coconut rum, right. Bacardi, I always start thinking this is what all the rum stuff was when they had rum wars or they were getting their rum ration on the UK ships. It had to be something more like this. Mm -hmm. Something that was high proof, tasty. Hmm. Yeah. Not Sat in a barrel for a while. Hmm. I almost that would a... keep me from uh from doing some kind of out of control, you know, mutiny right there if you oh, gave yeah. me that as a rum ration. <laughs> I'd be like, we're going to take over the ship. Try a bit of this Hampton. I'm good. Keep serving that. <laughs> I will stay. What about what about a little bit of gunpowder? Okay. I must get a little of the, the scent of yes. the gunpowder. Yeah, which is actually like cordite. There's almost okay. that cordite type. That's funny you say that. I'm not sure I would have thought that. But yeah, after there's been... <laughs> Unfortunately, we've been in areas after shots have been fired and you have that. Maybe, let's just well, say it's the range. Yeah. <laughs> Rather than some places we've been. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I like it. Interesting. Um, like I say, definitely unique. One of the better rums I've had. I don't know how to score it. I'm ready to score. <laughs> just jump Although right you're, I'm with well, you. I'm just going to score it. Do I like it? Yes, I like it. Is it a little weird? Yeah, for me, it's weird. I'm going to give it a good 88. I'm, well, I'm thinking low 90s, but I just don't know oh. where to go in there. I See, think this, is, this into gets that. into the really good rums, I think. I don't know. I'd have to have like a rum expertise. Yeah, no. So but that's I guess why I'm saying, palette. do I enjoy it? I enjoy it. I'll just go with 90 for now. Wow. 88. Yeah. The two, we'll throw sure. in the two yeah, points. 88, 90. Yeah. yeah. Just by standard. Yeah. All right. Well, um, price range. This is $120, $130. Yeah. I don't know about that. A little pricey. A little pricey for Cordite. 
<laughs> and Earth, wow. Yeah, Earth, Cordite, and a great house. Huh. Mm. And it doesn't say how old it is or anything. I don't know. I mean, again, not that age means a whole bunch, but old single Jamaican rum. Old single. What the heck does that mean? Single distillery? Old single Jamaican rum. See, that's the weirdness. I don't like all the weirdness. I want to know what that means. But that's the only thing I throw. It's a little odd. Okay. That's all I'm saying. We can come back and do it. Well, you can always go to uh, uh, Patreon, look up Scotch Test Dummies. If you like me pointing out that old single Jamaican rum is odd to me, you can go support the show for as little as a dollar a month. Where do we get these? Go to scotchtestdummies.com. You can pick up glasses. Uh, we didn't even use them. Oh. Glass toppers, uh, barrel caps, that's what we call them, and what water droppers, yes. hats, all kinds of stuff. Help support the show. It keeps the lights on, keeps the whiskey coming. <laughs> scotch it. You scotch got. Solange. Dummies. Pop. Dummies. Oop. Damn, I got stuff. off. <laughs>